Beachfield Nursing Home Group started in the 1980s when Tom Rowland developed Beachfield Manor for the purposes of uh, providing a home for his mother and believed that if it was good enough for his mother, it would be good enough for the other prospective residents. The Beachfield Nursing Home Group now has over 200 beds. We're sitting outside here, our latest uh, home, Mount Hybla in Katsanok, which has 66 beds. Well, the care in the homes is person-centred care, which means it's based on an individual assessment of the person's needs, both health care and social needs. And the activities uh, in the home are just as important as ensuring their basic health needs are looked after. We want our residents to feel part of a community. We want them to feel it is a homely environment. Families and friends can visit at any time they wish. In fact, we like to integrate visitors into the social activities taking place here for the residents. The average staffing of each of the homes is on a one-to-one -one basis with the number of residents. Very qualified nurses, clinical nurse managers, and qualified care assistants. Each of our homes has significant external garden space, and we've developed sensory gardens for sitting out for residents and their families. We're sitting here in the sensory garden attached to Mount Hybla. And horticultural therapy is a very important part of the activities provided in the homes. The individuals can pay directly uh, for their nursing care. Uh, they can get tax relief on those payments. If they don't have the income or the resources in order to pay for nursing care, all of our homes are approved under the fair deal, where the government will make a contribution towards the cost based on a, a means assessment of the individual resident. Please feel free to contact us. Call our directors of nursing to make an appointment to come and see our homes. Have a look around, talk to nurses, other residents, and get a feel for the ambience and the care that's provided in our homes. It'll help you decide whether it's right for you or your loved one.